Hi, this is Sherry Miller, Certified Arborist with Billmar Landscape. I came across the property today. I was walking down the street and I saw this olive tree. Beautiful. Nicely trimmed, thinned out, not too much leaves taken out. Still has foliage in the crown up here. The foliage plays a key part in a tree's survival. Having foliage helps bring up everything from the soil, all the minerals in the water, up through the tree. And then we have the photosynthesis process and the transpiration process where the water actually will turn to vapors and leave through the leaves. So knowing that the foliage is so important on a tree, why would you do this? The same kind of tree. Right there. You see it? It's an olive tree. They've butchered it. They've cut down to each branch and left a li couple little little tiny uh, branches coming off with a few pieces of leaves. This is wrong. This is extremely wrong. Now this tree has very little chance of bringing everything up through the soil that it needs to survive. The photosynthesis process is being corrupted. This tree, let alone, it has all these cuts. I don't know if you can see them all along the the branches where they just butchered and hacked away at this tree. This is what happens when you get an inexperienced tree worker or a non-knowledgeable tree worker. When you trim trees, you should only remove 30% of the tree in one pruning cycle. You, re you remove too much, the tree can decline and die. A lot of people do this to olive trees, thinking this is how an olive tree is supposed to look. You see that one? I don't know if that one looks good to you. Or how about this one, where it actually looks like a tree. Once someone does this to a tree, the next tree trimmer has little choices to make. They pretty much have to follow the same cuts this person made. So this tree is just going to continually be butchered. If you keep doing this to a tree, it will decline and die. Trees add value to properties. So if you have a nice 30-year-old 30, 30 olive tree here die, now you got to pay to get it removed, dig out the stump, and then put a new tree in. So that's almost a thousand dollars for someone not knowing what they were doing. Give me a call at Billmar Landscape. I'd be happy to come out, evaluate your trees, and let you know what we can do to keep them the healthiest and the best looking. Thank you.